Hey guys, welcome back. It's DT Silver Coin Hunter here and another mail call. And today I got a big old package from an auction that I joined with Big Flip Coins. And I want to show you what I got. So without further ado, let's crack into this nice big old bag and see what kind of goodies are inside. So the mail has been taking a little bit longer, I guess because of the holidays. So I've been actually awaiting this for about two weeks now. And it's finally here. Ooh. Okay, we got some goodies there. And we got another package of goodies right here. So sometimes I get carried away and I can't remember what I got. So it's almost a surprise when it comes in. Actually, I kind of do know what I have coming in here today, I believe. Come on, open up. The one thing you know you're going to get is good packing and good shipping from uh, Big Flip. You make sure that it's secure. And I know I got some slab stuff, so I'm making sure that it doesn't go anywhere. Here we go. My goodness, what is all this? I don't even know what I did. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's start with this one over here. Oh yeah, oh, now I remember. All right, so first, we got a couple of, we got one slabbed item here. Get my glasses on. Let's see what we got. So this is an MS-65-1958 Rosie. It's pretty nice. Very nice. Love Rosies. And... I got the Westward Journey nickel coin set here. This one I got from my grandson. I do like these. Uh, I know they're not real popular, but they're pretty nice. This will go into my grandson's collection. Nice shine to them. Certificate of Authenticity from the U.S. Mint. Way to go. Very nice. Open up strong. Out of the gate, and what do we got here? Let's see, a clipped, distorted planchet. Huh. So this was one of the finds in, in a box that I actually had Big Flip hunt for me. I'm not probably going to be able to see it very well, but the edge of the coin has a very noticeable indentation in it. Where apparently it was clipped. It's a 73 clipper. And just some constitutional here and a couple of wheat pennies. I'll go through those later. Next, next bag. Oh, this is very nice. So, one of the items I don't have very much of yet are these Bicentennial sets. Um, had a chance to pick, a, pick up a set in this auction for a pretty good deal. And so, I pulled the trigger on it. These are nice. They got the Ike, the Bicentennial Half, and the Bicentennial Quarters. Very nice addition to the collection. And as I say, don't have very many of those. We got the red. And gosh, I'm colorblind. Is that purple or blue? Blue. blue. Okay, blue. I had to have my wife help me out with that one. So this is the blue Ike. First one I've ever owned. 
Ain't he beautiful? Very cool. All right. I've been trying to win one of those on Rob Finds Treasure, but you got to have some big wallets in his in his auctions. It gets crazy in there. And uh, along with uh, that, I got a, a 1969 United States proof set uh, for a pretty good deal as well. And I love the proof sets, especially anything with silver in them. Very nice. All right. Put that back in over here. Let's see what else. We got here. Oh, yeah, this is nice. Make sure this. So, this is awesome. This is a war nickel, United States wartime silver nickel set with every year and every mint for the war nickels, the P, D, and the S. And this is the second one that I've gotten from him because I just love these. And I don't have a whole a lot of the war nickel sets, but this is just in a really nice protected um casing and war nickels are awesome 30 percent silver can't go wrong and with that i snagged a really nice bugs bunny 1955 ben franklin she looking pretty pretty nice that's very nice. It's got it. MS-63. First Bugs Bunny I've, I've owned. So really cool. Super cool. Got one more pack to open up. Let's see what the last one is. Feels kind of heavy. Oh, yeah. So I also got another 1968 proof set. A 1969 proof set and my favorite one of them all the 1970 proof set I just there's just something about the 1970 proof set that I just absolutely love nice and some nice toning on the nickel the other coins seem to be holding up with no toning at the, at the moment but another nice pickup and again I got a pretty good deal on it So I, that's about it for what I got from Big Flip at this auction. So I got a pretty good little bunch of stuff to kind of look at. Um, again, if you uh, love auctions, Big Flip has them every now and then on his channel. You need to go over there and check them out. Uh, he's a really super guy. He appreciates all, all the people that are in his streams all the time. And I love donating to him because you get a fair amount back and uh, great entertainment while you're in there. So check them out when you get a chance. Big Flip's coins um he's awesome so that's it for the video i would like to uh, just announce that i'm also later on tonight i'm going to go through some uncirculated brand new quarters 2020 quarters rockefellers and see if i can find some w's and i want to show off real quick lastly but not least some of these beautiful one ounce copper rounds that i will be giving away on my channel when I get onto my live streams. These are beauties. I don't know if you've seen them, but they're getting pretty popular. And they're just, they're really nice. Um, I've got a few of them going out to some of my channel friends for giveaways to try to help sponsor my channel and to also help them. Uh, we all try to help each other out in this community animals an owl super cool St. Gaudens and the Morgan 
So anyways, that's all I got for you today, guys. Uh, if you like this video, please like it and subscribe to my channel and click the bell so you can be notified when I do go live. Um, like I said, at the beginning of the year, I'm going to start some coin roll hunts with half dollars uh, where you all be able to purchase half dollars and I will search them for you just like a lot of the other channels do. I'm going to have my own twist on it and hopefully we can have some fun. So you all have a great night and thanks for watching. And again, remember, all coins matter. Peace out.